Welcome back to Let's Play Galactic Civilizations 2 with me, Get Daved. So, uh, those uh, star bases are gone. So, I guess that's what happens when the Empire crumbles. So, I guess it would probably. Uh, I think I'm gonna get Earth to. or somebody to focus on them. I just built a pretty fast constructor. So, I called it W10 because it can move 10 parsecs a turn according to the design screen. It could end up actually being faster than that. Who knows? It does look like I inherited their trade routes though, so that's nice. Uh, and conveniently, I have two freighters that I believe are sitting out there. Um, what's the button I want? View ships. Freighter. Where are you? Why can't I go to you? I don't know. I was under the impression I had some freighters that were just sitting around. I'm going to do something else to try getting access to them. I'm just going to take all my ships and move them around a bit. Send the transport back to Earth to load up the population there. Um, send you guys, I guess, back to Earth. That's a good idea. A lot of my colonies aren't defended at all, so now would probably be a good time to rectify that a little bit. The Eagle ships are... The Eagles, I would even call them, are primarily offensive ships, but... Oh yeah, and we were going to look at the spoils of uh, battle. Now... This planet is only, like, class 5, right? But it's producing 81 research. How is that possible? I'll tell you how. Boom. A little bit of an embassy bonus, and... Times 8. A 700% plus to the research output. So this place is, um... I believe amazing would be an adequate word. I don't believe in putting spaceports on crappy planets. It's one of the things I do. Um... Yeah. So, I'm glad we had that quick chat. And... I don't know. I, I wonder if I should even build the... Technological capital here, because that's equivalent to eight research centers. Like, that's a really big deal. I think I'm going to, actually. So, we're gonna... With two things left, we're gonna cancel this, because it just doesn't produce as much research. And it could be good for a lot of other things, and that's what we're gonna focus on. So... I'll get a trade good there. I'm going to scrap the orbital fleet manager because I don't really like flighting, fighting over my planets very often. Um, maybe some of you who know the game a bit better are cringing in horror at that, but that's how I roll. And instead, I may put some research centers up, but... Uh, Not gonna be anything too crazy. And an approval bonus, so that means morale. I may go ahead with that one. I get to make up my mind later though. And I'm gonna switch them to the new constructor as well so I can get some uh, ships on these resources because research resources are really valuable. You know what? I'm gonna buy that one now because I've got a ton of money and I would rather really lock up that resource. Oh yeah, you're going back to Earth. I was trying to hunt down a freighter at one point, I believe. So, Singularity Driver, we've got a decent gun there. Advanced Diplomacy, Xeno Business. This lets me increase my... Uh, Influence. I think I'm going to focus on sensors, though. I like to clear that one out uh, kind of early on. Quilas, upgrade me a station. Look at how fast that ship goes. And over here, too. Launch me a constructor. Build me a starbase. And we've got it. Setting them up at resources is quite easy. 
advanced sensors improved. Like, I mean, look, we can all get more upgraded sensors again. And two weeks to finish off that tree. Why not? And I think I might sort of establish these as formal borders for my empire, so I might actually start putting up a few star bases here and there. Looks like Jerk over here put an influence star base in my territory. I don't take kindly to that. Uh, but let's have a talk with everyone. Let's see where the technology situation has gone. Invention matrix. What can I give you for that? Yeah, oh, beam weapon theory. And chaff. Oh, these guys. It's pretty easy to take advantage of them in diplomacy. Send. Advanced miniaturization. I'd still love that. There we go. Chaff is actually kind of valuable just because... A lot of people are using missiles as their preferred weapons, and these guys, as it turns out, are quite militaristic. So, I'll take that. Advanced life support, like, that's basically unlimited range. Medium scale building I'd really like. I'd like all those things, what can we do for it? Laser 2, laser 3. I don't think I'm going to get those things. Okay, let's try on a smaller scale. I would like advanced logistics quite badly. Because I do feel kind of limited by the... limited by the puniness of my fleets. Okay, then you won't... No, I'm not trading away sensors. I'll give you a little bit of money. Screw you guys. I've got nothing. Whoops. Meant to talk to you. Now that is some interesting stuff. Yeah, I didn't think I'd be able to get it. I don't think I'll be able to trade anything with them. Manufacturing centers though. That's pretty good for some pretty basic weapons technology, getting manufacturing centers. I'll take it. Shields are pretty good. And Starbase defenses, and I'll throw in some money. And I'll throw in... Okay, he caught on to that one. Uh, advanced life support, and maybe we can get one more thing in there. Two more things, and some money. Alright, that's pretty good. Pretty good negotiation. I feel like I'm taking advantage of them, uh, cause I am. But they're weak, and afraid of me, and I'm a good diplomat in this. Yeah, load me up. I'll give you alliances for it. I have to give you up much. I'm not interested in those. Alright. Yes, I wish to upgrade Mining Starbase. You need battle stations installed to get a lot of the good stuff. Hmm. There is a famine. on a team. <laughs> I don't know. I don't mind forking out some money so my people don't starve. Alright, we've got good sensors now. That's exciting. Um, this tree is really good for building good influence star bases, which is something I may consider kind of soon here. Um, in the meantime, though... 
let's just take a look at our different options here. Advanced logistics I may still go for. Large scale building, but I don't have medium. I'm confused. Ah, I see what happened. We skipped a level in the tech tree, everybody. Well, medium it is, that won't take long, and I want it. So, we'll be able to build one size class larger for our ships. It's pretty exciting. It's a good time. All right, and we're still building transports on Earth. That's a mistake. All right, I'm gonna go back to massive constructor assembly because I want to pimp out my star bases, but that'll wait. I'll see you next time.